So today we're back playing a game that I haven't played in over a year and we're gonna see if it's any better or if it's still the same. So we're gonna be playing Backstretch Battles Remastered or as it is called now just Backstretch Battles and you can see they're on V2.15 and I mean there's nothing different in the description I'm pretty sure this is like the same description they had over a year ago it still says do not wreck people intentionally although you are allowed to do that in VIP servers and it says there's new logos and a new menu for the next gen game pass I believe you can see there's only 74 people playing the game back in the day the game used to reach like 900 almost 1k but that was usually when americans were awake usually on the weekend when americans are awake this game can reach like 300 400 players which is more than i on project apex and i mean there isn't anything new you can find here besides these next gen cars which i think we will be using it's only 89 robux the prices of game passes have definitely gone down so let's get the game pass and let's start playing the game first thing i know this is this menu i'm pretty sure this menu was added a while ago but i've never made a vid with it in the game i'm pretty sure and i mean it's just very sick it looks nice it's very smooth or at least it does work there's all these different stuff here like the draft color draft to the radio the speedometer v2 which is like behind your car there's the improved camera and the race progress line which is here at the bottom honestly this race progress line is one of my favorite features you can basically see where you are in the race how far away you are from the race finish and how far you are from everybody else basically usually it would be just like a group of people in the same spot i think there's like at least two people here but they're not loading since i joined in the middle of the race we of course still have the game pass shop and the racer club if you guys didn't know there's this racer club which you can get it's like a monthly subscription and if you get it you get the game passes all of them for like one month or two months or however long you get it so you instead of buying each game pass you can just buy the subscription for the one month you're gonna play the game or whatever because you never know if you're gonna quit or not there's also customize here which is the same oh my god they still have the scheme idea okay so i think copyright in customize is not an issue anywhere because i'm pretty sure they removed custom skins for a while because of copyright issues and that's it in terms of the menu let's see the cars i just bought ballad cars what are these oh it looks like they're custom liveries as well because these look like roblox usernames outery i know outery he used to drive for me in a bbr league okay let's spawn his car um it's green okay it's an ugly car this Schoolberg guy has a lot of liveries so let's spawn one of his liveries maybe they're good wash away um this looks slightly nicer uh i like the car model though it's the next gen cars and they're very nice looking i think this game pass is basically just buying liveries as you can see one of the new features as well is that you can vote for the track oh my god someone just pushed me off i'm gonna vote for darlington this was added a while ago and you can see some of the new tracks like celestial road and i just died that are very good i like the new tracks there's a lot of new tracks that are super detailed and well made and i got a new car for this race there's so many people here as well this is definitely gonna be an intense race and there's this kid called forza ferrari if i'm being honest i'm not the biggest ferrari fan so i might have a problem with him but considering this is a public server i have to behave myself and avoid committing any crimes there you go the lights are up i really like the new lights i mean i remember back in the day when we used to play this game all the time we would beg for them to add like some sort of countdown or light system and they finally did it insanely because you want to know when the race is starting and not just like be confused and look at this race it started already and there's people being oh my god oh okay well we okay well okay Okay, am I out? Am I out? Okay, we're still in this race. Bro, it hasn't even been 20 seconds into my first race back in this game and we already got taken out and we are dead last, P12. But you can see a lot of cool features now in this game. It's very smooth now. I mean, the core mechanics of you just driving in a straight line and trying to finish first are still the same. It's just a bit more fun and easier to 
do, you can see your speed down here behind the car instead of like the old SPS meter or whatever it was called. You can also see where we are in terms of the track at the bottom here. So we're almost like a quarter or a third of the way there. And we are dead last. I think there's no one behind me. And you can see these little draft blocks. They're blue now, which is kind of sick. And you can, I think there's a game pass you can buy, which makes them rainbow. Just so you if you want to stand out a little bit from the crowd, I might get them to be honest after this race. I wish there was a way though to choose whatever color. Oh my God, please do not take me out. But I wish there was like a way to customize your draft blocks and choose whatever color you want. Because maybe you don't want the entire rain. Oh my god, I got taken out again. This game is gonna start to piss me off. If you guys want me to make videos on this game, doing challenges or like recording this game with face cam, let me know in the comments below because I would definitely do it. Also, smash that like button if you're enjoying this game once again. Oh, we're catching this. Ca no, no. Why is he taking me out? Isn't that toxic? Isn't I thought I thought you could get banned for that. Why are people taking me out? That's actually dumb, bro. I was just trying to bump the raft with the kid, and he can completely took me out oh my goodness and we're getting very close to the finish please give me catch up i want to catch up to this crowd i want to actually win my first race back if you guys didn't watch my streams last weekend i had to do like 20 races just to win one but that was because everyone in my server was targeting me so now at least they're not doing that but it seems like i don't have enough speed to catch up please 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 give me the draft give me the draft give me the draft oh my god please let me catch up or basically at the end there there's no distance left. I can literally see the finish line. And we're getting a lot of draft now. We're going 310. Almost 320. Please take each other out. Oh my god, we're in this. We're in this. We're in this. We can win this. We can win. We can win. We can win. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Don't take me out. Don't take me out. Going down the middle. No. No. I got third. No. I t I'm tied for third. What the heck? They even added like a leaderboard. You can see the gaps now. I finished third, but there's like no time between me and second. We're basically tied. Does that count as me getting second? Oh my goodness. I was so close to winning my first race back. That comeback was insane. I got taken out like twice and somehow I almost won. Let's vote for the Saltwater Speedway. It seems like people are voting for ramps as well. But I want to try out the new tracks that I haven't made videos on. Bro, I was so close to winning this. Oh my god. Three chance of the win. I don't know, like one millisecond away from like P2, which is annoying. Uh, let's spawn the 99 uh oh my god there is a duck on this car okay that's kind of funny but um why does the car not move is this car broken um no it works okay there you go everyone in the server is also quiet let's say gg about the first race is anyone gonna respond nope nobody responded everyone is quiet okay i mean one of the best parts about this game is like when you're in the middle of the race because it's so easy to drive you just need to hold w for most of the time like half the time you would see people typing and fighting in the chat or arguing because they got taken out. Oh my god. Are you serious? Why do I? Why am I the only one that gets taken out at the start, dude? What the heck? Oh, and it's so hard to line up your car again. Please, please, please. I don't want to get out of the catch-up zone. Okay, we're going 330 because we are so far last. And we're going into the aquarium. Or like, we're basically underwater now on this map. This map is pretty sick. They've done a great job with the new maps. Like, they're super detailed or nice looking. Even though most of the time you're just focused and on the road you can't really look elsewhere it's still nice to have them instead of like a boring road and next to it is the grass although no offense to the daytona track it is one of my favorites as well it just makes the game a little bit more interesting to have detailed tracks like this and it just looks higher quality oh my god oh my god what the heck how did i just go under that car with no damage oh my god oh my please please oh i rolled over okay rip i flipped that's such an l oh my god God. you know what i want them to add let me know if you agree with this in the comments below wouldn't it be cool if they added like car damage like each car has a health bar and the more you rammed into people and crash into others your car would get damaged and after a while your engine would fail or your car would die or something that's why like if they don't want toxic driving they can just do that and no one is gonna be trying to hit another car you know everyone is gonna stay focused or maybe someone is gonna get their friend to target someone and take them out completely so their friend can win oh my god we're getting a lot of drafts right now 
Come on, come on, come on. Give me all the drafts. I want to win this race very badly. Why aren't the top three? Like, these two cars have the same number. And we're second. Oh my god, we might get P1. No, no, no. Don't spin, don't spin, don't spin. Under control. Okay, we're under control. We did lose all our positions, though. And somehow we went through those two cars. And I almost took out that guy by accident. Okay, oops. I might have taken out those two people by accident. Totally not on purpose. Please don't ban me from the game. We're currently third. We're now second and we're chasing down first i think i'm just gonna bump the raft with him um nope he doesn't want to bump the raft so i guess we will take p1 for now but i don't think it's gonna last that guy almost took us out oh they're fighting they're ramming into each other we're currently halfway through the race and i don't know if we're gonna win or, or not it's kind of risky to be in the lead when it, the finish line is still so far away oh two more people joined the fight no this is gonna get messy please don't touch me no 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 okay i'm gonna back out out. i'm gonna take p5 for now because i just don't want to fight which people see someone already got taken out another person might get taken out now i'm just gonna stay behind them and watch let's do the smart tactic my biggest weakness when i'm doing like the safe strategy where i'm lurking and i have to push at the end is that i don't know when to start pushing sometimes i start pushing too early and then i just end up like being in p1 and then someone steals it back or i push too late where i just start pushing and i don't reach p1 one by the time the race ends so i guess like if you want to guarantee winning you just need to figure out that strategy of when to start pushing and as you can see the race finisher is right there we're very close at the end and uh should i start pushing now because if i just push now i'm gonna get p1 easily uh it's just about these guys at the front i want them to fight a little bit this guy this guy is also doing the lurk strategy but he's ahead of me should i start pushing now i just need to get a lot of speed okay we're pushing we're pushing we're going 300 we're going 300 going for the overtake oh my god these people almost took me out we're currently p1 let's get this guy to push me no 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 oh my god we actually got taken out at the finish no dude that guy tried to overtake me and oh my god we had the win in the back dude i was leading them and they were taking each other out but they took me out with them i got p6 dude that's actually so annoying i think i'm gonna try one more race because i just have a feeling and i could win and i think we're gonna go with the iconic ramps track they added this arctic track recently for christmas it does look like the half barrel or what was it called i don't remember the name of the track but it looked like that it looked like a half barrel i guess it's just made out of snow instead and for this race we're gonna spawn the number 36 the select bingles okay that's an interesting name i would say if i'm being honest i don't like bingles the cat this guy is trying to get a head start he's gonna push like last minute nope he's okay ow okay thank you for the boost i wanted to see if he's gonna push like as soon as the lights were gonna turn green to get like a head start so i guess he did. did someone just disappear i just saw someone like disconnect or something this is the ramp track so it's kind of chaotic if you're going onto the ramps and so on it also makes you lose a bit of speed oh my god that guy got to oh my god i flipped i i ow my head that hurt oh my god those two people trying to take each other out no why would that guy oh my god what the heck bro i was getting an insane draft and that guy just took me out thankfully we didn't flip or anything so we can catch back very easily we're getting closer to the end we already did half this oh my god that guy got completely killed what the heck this guy doesn't even have a liver oh my god this is why you should always pay attention to the road bro i was looking back and i didn't see the ramps and i completely crashed into them and those two people took each other out okay so Somehow I'm already second and there is a big gap to third. Let's see if we can catch up to P1. I had an intense fight with this P1 guy, so he might fight me very hard. I'm just gonna go next to him and see what he does. Yep, he's pushing me. He's pushing me. Okay, let's just stay in this place. He's gonna try... What is he... Is he actually trying to take me out? Oh my goodness. What is this kid? I, I thought he was going for the side draft, but I think he's straight up trying to take me out, dude. Oh my god. I almost took him out there by accident because he was coming my way let's see we're getting the overtake again bro this kid is focusing on me focus on that other 
guy trying to overtake us. I think I have a good chance of winning if the- Oh my god! Oh my god! Yes! 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 yes, yes. They took each other out. They took each other out. I actually have a good chance of winning. What the heck? I'm leading. The win is right there, dude. If they keep fighting each other, no one is gonna catch me. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Am I gonna win this? Yes! Yes! I'm gonna get a win in my first video back playing BBR or just breaking- I mean, not breaking bad. Uh, I mean, backstretch battles. There you go. We won the race by like two chance or something. All right, bro. It took me so long to win a race on stream, but it only took me three races on video to actually get a win in this game. I'm quite happy of getting a win, guys. Smash that like button if you enjoyed this video. And if you want me to keep uploading backstretch battles videos, comment down below what you want to see me do. Like, do you want car reviews? Do you want just funny moments, crash compilations, or maybe challenges that you comment? If you have like a challenge idea, comment as well. And also subscribe to the channel so not to miss my future videos on this game or other Roblox, NASCAR, and racing games. And if you want to watch another Backstretch Battles video that I made a while back, click the video that pops up on the screen right now. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.